Listen, I've got to lead a bird hike in about five minutes. I'm at the office sitting at my desk, yeah. I've got 45 happy birthdays Facebooks on my computer. <laughs> Going out to see what's happening outside to see if there's anybody interested in, in a bird walk. I'm supposed to have lead a, a bird walk right now, but it looks like pumpkins have taken over. <laughs> uh, anybody interested in a bird walk down to the bird blind? Okay, we're gonna be leaving shortly. You need some binoculars? Thank you. Make sure you keep the strap around the neck at all. We'll go very slowly down to the bird blind. I see ducks. Ducks on the marsh. We have to park. We have to wait for It's such a nice day. I think it's just good to be out here in front of the blind. A lot of ducks on the marsh because it's my migration time. They're migrating south. And uh, if, if those of you that have binoculars, so you don't even need binoculars. You can see there's some, some ducks that are diving that just di disappear. Those are diving ducks. And there are ones out there like a redhead, redhead duck um, and their coots. They're, those are divers. And why they call it a bird blind? Why? Why do you think? Because birds can't see you. Because birds can't see you, yeah, they're blind. <laughs> but also, you don't disturb the birds when you're in here. We catch them and put bands on them, uh, which are a little like a bracelet that has a number, so we can identify them when we catch them again. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's a fed federal bird banding station that we you have mean, here. You mean, like, tracking them down? Yeah. They are? Wherever they go, we, we, we know it's that bird, yeah. It's like know. a license plate. That way you know, oh, this bird flew this far. That's right, that's right. This bird was here, but it went all or, the way over or, here. Or we banded it five years ago and it came back. <laughs> so it's lived for five years in the wild and survived. We see red-winged blackbirds and meadowlarks and birds of prey like red tail hawk and, and uh, once in a while we'll see a bald eagle and we'll see gulls, ring-billed gulls, and always lots of ducks on the marsh. Boy, that's a beautiful beetle. Yeah, let's close it so it doesn't get away. And at least it has air holes. We'll eventually want to let it go, but for a while you can show it to everybody. She's amazing. Can I see? <laughs> <laughs> hey. Hello. Thank you so much. <laughs> He's trying to get out. Yeah. Damn. Hey, I can hear it. It was like zzz. Oh, well, my husband's a suffering here. He's a beetle. I have never saw a flying beetle before. <laughs> Wonderful that we're having an open house today with all these families coming because there isn't any school. So they have a lot of fun coming out for the day. This is the best birthday present to spend my 87th birthday out here at Sombrero Marsh. Beautiful blue sky day and lots of ducks on the marsh. Happy birthday, Elk. <laughs> Yeehaw! Isn't that great? Happy birthday. Oh, thank you. Oh. <laughs> Love you so much. Same. <laughs>